Michaela, congratulations. You guys, it came down to the final defensive stop. Tell me what you were talking about in the huddle and what you had to execute defensively. Yeah, for sure. I think Colorado's a great team, a testament to them. They came back when we were up by a lot. And in the huddles, we were just talking about stay, stay kind of steady, stay poised, because we know that we're going to be in situations like this in Pac-12. And uh, everybody's good from 1 to 12. And so just continue to stay, stay poised and just do what we do on defense. This isn't your first close game either. You've had to overcome tough wins. Uh, what Talk about the resiliency of your team. No, oh, yeah, for sure. Uh, Arizona State, we kind of came down to the last kind of 20 seconds, and they, they got a shot on the goal, a couple shots on the goal in that game. And so, yeah, I, I, really, I just I really, really appreciate this team and just how hard we work. And I guess like, it's a testament to how hard we work and how resilient we are. We do fight. We fight for each other, and that's kind of one of our staples in our team, fighting for each other. Speaking of hard work, you've worked hard to make your game more versatile. Tonight, or today, you've been able to score inside, from three, from mid-range. What's all the work you've put into to become someone who can be a multifaceted threat out there? For sure. My coach challenged me uh, after my freshman year, just help, telling me that I needed to be the go-to player. And I took that as a heart. And I was working really hard at, at that summer. And so I know that in order to get better for my team, I needed to be more versatile and get better in those areas, whether that's out from the outside and the inside, to help my team. And it's paid off. And it's so nice for you to be here in Colorado your home state, three-time Colorado State Player of the Year. Your family and friends are here. How many people are here? Uh, for my list, there was like 40, and then my high school came and got group tickets. So it was just really, really humbling <laughs> to come back and to see everybody, that kind of see where our basketball kind of started for me. Absolutely. You totally showed out for your whole crowd. And then finally, your team is still undefeated right now. What's the pressure that comes with that game after game? I think there's no pressure because we try, to not, try not to talk about that. I think that we take it one game at a time, as cliche as that sounds. We really do because like, when you, once you get into Pac-12, everybody is just so lethal. And so continuing to focus on one game at a time and continuing to just get it better every day. All right, one game at a time. You guys are still marching on undefeated. Congratulations, Michaela. Thank you so much, Ross.